So let's think about the power of seduction. Is it being vulnerable and telling your whole life on a first date? Or is it being a bit mysterious, creating a bit of tension, giving him drops of uncertainty and letting him figure you out? Now, which one of these sound hot? Hello queens, it's Greta Bereshete here and for the best dating and relationship advice, please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell to be notified when I upload a new video every Wednesday and Sunday. So, you feel like a relationship is getting a bit dull and boring. He is not making much effort. He basically has you all safe where he wants to all available for him and on top of it he knows every single step that you take or maybe he doesn't even ask to know every single step that you take because you are so nice and you report it to him so he's just not that worried now ladies an open book does not spice things up an open book makes things again dull and boring it's the mystery that creates tension, spice, and keeps the relationship a bit on the edge, plus gets guys' blood boiling. So in this video, I will share with you three ways how to be mysterious in a high value way. So the first tip is more for dating. Don't share your whole life in one go. And ladies, here is a story that happens a lot and men are very aware of this. So when a woman meets a guy that she likes, she basically wants to bond with him, share stories and get to know each other better. Then before you know it, he knows her whole life in the first 24 hours that he has met her. As a girl, you might think, yeah, that's perfect. As now he knows everything about me, we bonded, it was so much fun, we really enjoyed each other's company, and now we can live happily ever after. It's fantastic, right? No. Ladies, that's not how it works. When you share your whole world with him in the first couple of dates, you basically don't give him a reason to date you anymore. Now he will be more interested in Oh, who's that girl that I don't know about? I wonder what's her story. You might think, no, but I just shared it all with him. How could he just leave me out like this? Well, women bond through talking and sharing. Men bond through having fun together. So just because you feel all attached to him, it doesn't mean that he does. Sure, he may like you, but he will still look at it as it was just a first date. Even if you talked for 12 hours, had heart-to-heart -heart conversations, he cooked for you when you slept with him, ladies, it is still just a first date. Even if you feel head over heels hooked, to him, you are still just a first date. And actually, this is a very common strategy that men use on women in order to sleep with them. Open, bonded conversations, cooking for girls, then having sex on the first date. Ladies, please watch my video, Games Guys Play on Women, which I'll link it down right there and up right here. So you understand the strategy behind it and you do not fall in their traps. So what do you do? Keep your dates not too long, but fun. Share the things that you're passionate about, but don't give it all in one go. Dating should be about having fun together and seeing do you click. Don't be an open book. Keep the mystery and let him think. I wonder what else I don't know about this one. I suppose to find out more, I will just have to ask her on the second date. Tip two is for relationships and dating. 
let him pursue you focus on you put yourself first in dating relationship and marriage now ladies this is how you should be creating mystery in a relationship in a healthy natural way by letting a man pursue you as it's his job not yours sure you can reciprocate but it should not be 50 50 as you are as a woman not a pursuer our natural way is to create some mystery and uncertainty by trusting him yes you showing him that you trust him will actually create a healthy amount of mystery and uncertainty for him as you will not be nagging you will not be stalking you're not going to be controlling or seeking attention and it will make him wonder why why is she not stalking me why is she so confident is it because she's busy is it because she's dating someone else so now ladies when you think about it you're actually creating the mystery by trusting him being busy and confident in your life and reaching for your stars will actually give the ultimate happiness in your life for you not the guy but reaching for your stars now ladies it does not get healthier than that the third tip is nailing a texting again it's for dating relationships and marriage ladies texting is super important as literally majority relationships fail just by text for example he says hi how are you and you send him a whole essay of every single detail that has happened on your day ladies this is actually even worse than the first example as in the first example at least a woman got to go on a date and overshared everything there Whereas if you're sending him long essays like this, it's very likely that you won't even get to be asked out. I mean, what's the point to get to know each other in person if he already knows everything about you through text? What is the point to actually ask you out or get you on a date? or even call you? So you would repeat all of it on the phone or on a date? Ladies, that's boring texting is only for staying in touch yes you can share some bits and pieces but the story of that specific detail that you're so excited to share with him over text comes out when he actually asks you out not through text and ladies since texting is nearly the most important part of dating i have created a texting video sharing all the tips and tricks on how to stay attractive through text there is literally everything that you need to know about texting in that video it is a paid video but i will link it down in the description box just in case you want to get it so now you know my three tips for how to be mysterious in relationships and dating and i know i just mentioned to you to get my video what to text a guy but ladies i also have a free video on what not to text and lots of examples of what is too keen and an open book and you can find that video just by following the link right here and i'll drop it down in the description as well so ladies like it if you liked it share it with the ladies who need it join my secret society on facebook which is called greta's high value women school where we are all in the same boat learning how to be high value and bring out the best in our guys follow me on my instagram my instagram is private it's ladies only and if you would like some one-on-one -on -one or group coaching please book me through my website and get in touch with me through whatsapp as this is where i coach thank you so much for watching queens kisses from london Mwah.